I'm Carolyn Honia with Lake Norman Breastfeeding Solutions. I want to talk to you today about some of the products on the market um, that are either lanolin, balms, ointments, the different options for sore nipples or for pumping lubricant. It used to be that we recommended lanolin for breastfeeding moms and lanolin used to even be given out in the hospitals. But based on some recent studies, we know that lanolin use can increase the risk of thrush and mastitis because it's so thick, it tends to trap bacteria and other things in the skin. So we've moved away from lanolin, even though what lanolin did well was keep the skin well moisturized and supple. And we do know that nipples heal faster when the skin is nice and moist um, and then it can be more elastic and it heals faster. So moist wound healing is helpful for nipples, but since we've moved away from lanolin, um, let's talk about some alternatives. So if you just have mild sore nipples, the best thing to do is actually just to hand express a little bit of breast milk or colostrum onto your nipples after nursing and let that breast milk soak in and work its magic. Um, the breast milk can moisturize your skin. It's got those great antibacterial properties that help prevent infection. So for sore nipples, you don't need any products. Um, just apply a little bit of your own breast milk and let that do its job. But if your nipples are actually cracked or bleeding or you have nipple trauma, first of all, get a lactation consultant to help you work on addressing the latch or whatever's causing that nipple trauma. But also we wanna kinda kick things up a notch with treatment for cracked nipples or nipple trauma. The product that I recommend for cracked nipples is Meta Honey Wound Gel. You can find this on Amazon or if you're local, we keep it in stock at Lake Norman Breastfeeding Solutions. We like Meta Honey Wound Gel because it has medical grade Manuka honey. And medical grade is really important. Um, we cannot use food grade Manuka honey because of the risk of botulism for infants. But Meta Honey Wound Gel has been irradiated to make it safe for baby, so baby can come in contact with this. And studies have found that this works better than anything else at healing cracked nipples. It, it's great for that moist wound healing, but Manuka Honey also has properties in it that help to protect you from bacteria and thrush. Um, so this is what we recommend if your nipples are actually cracked or bleeding, in addition to working with a lactation consultant on latch. But I wanna to talk to you about a newer trend um, with nipple ointments. So recently, a lot of companies have been coming up with these great balms for nipples as well. This is um, Lansano's new balm. It's an organic nipple balm. It's made with organic oils and other soothing ingredients. Um, our favorite way to use it, this is what it looks like out of the box, is for pumping lubricant. In fact, this little container fits perfectly in that kind of cup holder, I call it, that is on the back of a Spectra pump. So keep this handy or another similar brand of organic balm. And you'll see that it's clear. Um, it goes on really smooth. It's unscented. It's almost tasteless. And the best way to use it is just to apply just a tiny bit to your nipples in a Rila before pumping and it acts as a lubricant. So it makes pumping more comfortable for you. You feel like you glide within your pump flange instead of having as much abrasive friction against the plastic of your pump flange. So we highly recommend this product or one like it for pumping. You can also use this if your nipples feel just kind of dry or chapped, especially in the winter. You could use it for um, all kinds of other purposes too, like cracked hands or dry lips. So very all purpose. Um, but again, our favorite use is to use this product as a pumping lubricant. We carry it locally and you can also find it online.